welcome to Royd Gamer and this is GTA 5 online so this is going to be the second video where I will be setting up my nightclub and first I have to go to the nightclub and then I will be setting it up I will I will be opening few other businesses in the nightclub now there are a couple of businesses that I can set inside the nightclub the primary one is the one where the people comes in and I make a passive income from that uh, right now I am making around ten thousand dollar a day from that one However, it can be increased to many folds. So I have to run a few more businesses over there so that I could uh, increase more money over there. So let's get started. First, I have to visit the nightclub that I have over there. Let's mark it on my map and then visit it. I have set up a few other businesses. Uh, the counterfeit cash business is also over there. And I'm making money from that. This is just I have set it up just today and it's completely new so I cannot not going to be making that much of money but it will start making money shortly but right now let's go to uh, my nightclub and let's start making some businesses over there my nightclub is around around the place let's see uh, let's check it out where my nightclub is uh, that's my nightclub i think yeah, that's the one so let's mark it and move towards it Let's move towards it and let's start some business over there. So apparently you can make a lot of money from uh, completely passively. That's a great part of this nightclub. And for that very reason, nightclub is something that you should own in GTA 5 online. However, some of them are quite expensive and can cost you millions. You need to have that kind of money and since i got the criminal starter pack i got this car and few other things and i got almost two million cash so i'm using that money to buy some businesses and that club is one of my first businesses that i have just set up yesterday and i also launched a video that you can check it out on my channel if you haven't checked it out and but over there i just have this basic setup and that's just giving me some passive money already but this time I'm going to set up some more passive income from the nightclub. Um, for that I need to reach the nightclub which is quite far away from here. Now, uh, This is the place where I think uh, I have my another business. From there I'm moving to my nightclub that is the first business and probably the most, if not the most profitable, really good this can give you a really good amount of profit and along with that it's completely passive now in most of the jobs you really have to do something in order to keep the cash flowing make a lot of money from that now, or there are a couple of tasks couple of different kind of businesses from where you can make a lot of money but in those businesses you have to do something to keep that business running and it can take quite some time you have to go there visit there and those are not really passive so it can take some time but in the nightclub, once you set it up, it's mostly passive, so that's a really good thing. If you can own a multiple uh, nightclubs, then your income can really be really in millions, and that's something everyone should look for. So owning a nightclub is something I think you should do in GTA 5 Online if you have the cash. Now you can also, uh, of course, you can get some of the nightclubs at cheaper rate compared to the one that I have purchased. My nightclub was around 170k approximately. And uh, these are the, some of the games like the Headhunter, Protect the Targets. But right now I'm going to the nightclub and I'm going to set up some businesses over there. You can also make a, a ton of money from these games. Um, small, small games that are played by multiplayers. Many, many, many players participate in these games from all around the world. and you can make a couple of money from there also. You have to have a good score so that you can make a lot of money. But right now, my I am going to just uh, do something in the nightclub because I, this is the nightclub uh, that I have set it up yesterday. So I don't know all of the features over here, but you know, that was a crash. But definitely, um, I know what can be done over there. So I'm going to set that up. Let's see how far I can go in today's video. 
Now, if you are getting started with this GTA 5 online, then I would recommend you to, uh, if you have the money, to get a nightclub. If you don't have the money, then you can start other businesses that are also quite profitable, but those are not passive. So if you are, as you can just see, this is my nightclub and there are a couple of members over here. And they are actually my club members and this club has quite popularity. So these are members are always coming in and I'm making a ton of money from these people. So once you set up the basic things in the nightclub, these people will start coming in. You don't have to do anything over there. This is my security one that I have just bought yesterday. So there are like celebrity, you can bring on celebrities and different kind of people in your nightclub to increase the popularity. You can also do a lot of promotion to also increase the popularity. Now right now my nightclub is really popular and people are coming in. If eventually the popularity can decrease and when that happens, I actually have to um, do some promotion in order to increase the popularity once again. Now, if the popularity decreases, so does the people, so, and your earning will also decrease. Uh, but if you continue to increase your popularity, your business will continue to grow. But it's not always um, necessary just to give this, as, keep making this as the primary one. So you can also have other businesses that can be set up that I'm going to set up today inside the nightclub. You can go with that one also. This people's are just guarding my places and cannot go through. This shirt is a $4,000 shirt and looks kind of cool. So first and foremost thing, I have to go to the upper floors so that uh, from there I can go to the basement or you can just go it from another place but I like to go it from the upper floor. So let's get to the upper floor. Let's get this shirt. This shirt is really bright and has a nice glow. There it is. I can go to the next floor from this one. And from the upper floor, I will go to the basement. The PC is on that side. You can also dance inside the nightclub. This shirt is really bright. Cost me another 4000 USD. This shirt is quite nice also. It looks, it looks good. And this is my PC. This is my room from where I can access the businesses. Let's look into it once and let's see how much money I have earned so far. From just the basic businesses that are being done here. And this is a thing that you have to do it almost most of the time you have to register yourself as the vip or the ceo for this nightclub for that you have to for pc you have to press the m button or you can see that uh, i don't really have to access that and the popularity seem to be decreasing so uh, so far i have made around 31k which is quite good and you can also uh, convert that cash Take the cash um, because the maximum capacity capacity is I think around 70k and that's why it's better to just withdraw the cash sometimes. And let's see where is the safe, the wall safe. It's supposed to be around here. Let's see if I can find that the wall safe. Yeah, this is the one. So this is the place where I all of where I keep all of the money and to create safe inside the wall. And you can then get the cash to yourself. Yeah, we got the 31k. which is quite good. You can also transfer that money to yes, close the safe.
let's see if I can uh, transfer that to the bank. For that, you have to just visit your contact in the internet, GTA 5, and then you can go to the money and services. And we have the maze bank over here. See the maze bank, click on that, go to the main menu, and just deposit the money. 35k I have around this deposit. I can deposit the whole money or I can just deposit a bit of it. That would be better because just do it one more time. Having some cash in hand is useful. So let's have some cash and then deposit the rest of it. At 15k, a little bit more is needed. Deposit. I'm going to deposit 10,000 more. Now, let's deposit 2,500 more. Because if, uh, if you are killed by some player in the game, then they can actually get all of those money so it can be really risky to care to actually carry more than certain amount and deposit a little bit more let's say around 500 more another 500 would be better and that's it now let's go to the bunker room and there are also a few PCs over there. Okay. And the bunker room can be found from the elevator that is around, let's see, was it over here? Not on that side. Then From the other side, I guess. So I have to go to the basement. You can function your staff inside the basement. I went to the same place once again. Let's see if I can find the way this time. I think this is the place. I have to go in through this place and then go out. But I went to the went outside the room. Let's see where is the elevator now? I'm also quite new to this. Uh, there it is. So you just can go here. This place. Let's go to basement one. You have to come to the middle of this door in order to access those options. Let's go to the basement and then we can access the computer over there and then can do some business from there. This is the first time I'm going to set it up. I haven't done it before. So let's see how successful I am. It's taking quite a while to actually load this one. So once I go to the basement, uh, There are a couple of options. You can see the storage over there. There is a similar PC over there. And from there you can do all of the things that you want to do. Now you can second is the pharmaceutical research. The third is cargo and shipments. The Fourth one is sporting goods, organic produce, South American imports, printing and copying. And some of this, all of them are really profitable, but by far I think the most profitable ones would be the cargo and shipments and the South American imports. This is basically the import and export, I think the imports of the cocaine. So yeah, that is really uh, profitable. However, right now I'm just going to set up the cash creation. And eventually I think this can be uh, opened up once this business starts 
up and then uh, more money starts coming in then i can do a lot of different things right now there is another option that is sell goods so there are different kind of goods that you can sell like there are uh, different kind of goods over here but right now i have none of them because i don't have the availability of these goods i cannot actually sell all of the goods there are also upgrades you can do an equipment upgrade that's cost around 1.4 million you can also do a staff upgrade you can do a security upgrade now security upgrade is usually needed when uh, let's say you are running uh, this kind of businesses uh, illegal businesses and some police comes shows up and try to do some scrutiny and this security upgrade will help you to protect yourself from those kind of scrutiny to a great extent if not completely so i don't have any cocaine to sell like i told before you have no cocaine to sell in the south american imports but let's start with the basic one the um, the nightclub management warehouse management and the cash creation over here okay let's do that and once i do that let's see what is are you sure you would like to stop no that's not what i want so the cash creation process i think has started and any goods so far doesn't seem so any upgrades nope. the popularity is decreasing and right now made around 31k so is there anything else i need to do this was the pc from where you could access everything and you can also go down to the basement i guess it can be done from this one let's see if i can go down even further from here i can go to the nightclub and i think i have to collect few things so this is the warehouse i think so maybe easy i think he is the worker inside the club let's take this car out and let's see if there is anything i need to do just to get that cash counterfeit cash business starting and let's get out of this place exit the garage let's see if i need to do something right now it will take a while to just get out of this warehouse from the nightclub that's it it has loaded now all i have to do is i received an email let's check it out what kind of email have i received over here treasure hunt use the photographer in this email to identify the location of the treasure this is one of the game that you can follow it's one of the games that are going on right now but right now i am not really interested in the games so let's see if i need to pick up something or is there anything that i need to do right now what is that again garage and then there is the nightclub property motorcycle club club house those kind of customs bunker is there anything else i need to do in order to start the counterfeit cash business over here garage you know, premium race race series and then the time trial rival nightclub or enterprise office Let's go see San Andreas Flight School, so then cargo. And what the special cargo does over here, I don't know. So the store, strip club, stunt series, survival series, tattoo parlor, tennis, time trial, transform series, to the hunt. Doesn't seem that I need to do anything whatsoever. i think this thing has already started so let's go to the 
ammunition and so the first business i think has started over here i don't think i need to really collect anything because as i mentioned before this is a passive income so it doesn't appear that i need to do anything whatsoever this is rivals nightclub Then a time trial. I'm looking into it. Let's see if I need to do anything whatsoever. Ammunition is over there, just around the range. Let's get to the ammunition. And once you get to the ammunition, you need to get some few guns over there that I have got with the uh, criminal enterprise starter pack. Um, and I'm almost there. There's the ammunition. Let's get down and get some free guns. And I have to enter it from this side. Right this side, I don't know. Is that even open right now? To fight with this, I don't know why they start fighting with me. But now I am monster wanted. That's not something really desirable over here. See if I can get them here. I am. There was the entry. Now, uh, couple of guns from where I can select the one. This is the whole ammunition. store over here and then along with that you can also get the soda for one dollar let's see if that helps something that's it nothing interesting over here but yes definitely i can uh, get some guns why are the options not displaying? I think it's possible that since I am one step wanted, now showing up the option. Now it's gone. Let's now I think yes. That's what the problem. So let's browse some weapons and let's see if uh, 75k this minigun that's locked. That's free. So I have this gun for free. I get this one. Uh, did I need to pay this one? It doesn't appear to me. Okay, I think just I added a few things over there. That's why it uh, cost me some money. However, it was completely free. And the round into 16, that's what cost me the money. So I think I got this gun. Let's see if there is any other gun. Not free. Got this one. Definitely not free. Not free, not free, not free, not this one either. This one is free, sword or shotgun. Let's get this one also. 
Okay. Let's see if there is anyone. So the rifle. So we have this one. Not free, not free. So that Republican Space Ranger special fresh from the Galactic War. Especially the no ammo, no mag, just one brutal energy pulse after another. That's 100,000. It's mini SMG. Compact rifle. I have these guns and none of them are actually free. Cannot even purchase this one either because this one is uh, I can purchase. This is a infrared better fire and forget missile launcher for all of the moving targets needs parts of the festive surprise. There's a 75k launcher. There is another business that I'm going to set up in this one also. Uh, for that I have to go to the, uh, this gun is really interesting. The damage is however not that much. The highest damage I have over here is got a couple of one. The shotgun that I have is very really quite powerful. Let's see if any other pistols are actually useful to me. Combat pistol I have that one. Other ones don't need those one. When I get a sword, then the appears to have one over here. There are a few grenades, pipe bomb. What is that? Proximity mine. Let's get this one. I have two of this. This one is free combat grenade launcher. So I got this one. Grenades into two. You can add a few $500 option. Not needed right now. So that's it. I think I have got almost all of them. Uh, these are some members, I think. They look similar. Let's see if I can uh, do gears over here. Not this one, I think I look around the armor. This has a price tag of 100k and I'm going to purchase this one. Quite useful. That's it. Others are not yet available. Shoes. Are they useful? The it seems not going to provide any kind of protection, I guess. Just in order to look stylish, you can buy some of them. I think I like this one. This goes with this shirt that I'm wearing right now. Is there any glowish? Uh, shining kind of sneaker over here. Running shoes. Smart shoes was that. Just to make you look smart. Sneakers are good enough. So let's get uh, one of them. Not this one. Not this one. Let's look a little bit more. This goes with the shirt, but it looks very basic, so we're not going with that one. There are others over here, and this one is quite okay. 1600. Oh no, yeah, that's okay. Let's get this one. Okay, so that's it. I have the guns now. Let's see the flip flops. No, I don't really like that one. Loafers. Not that great. Sports shoes. Not great either. Sports shoes. That should be it. Okay, so let's get out. Get out from this ammunition. Let's 
let's check out our weapons i have a couple of them now that's a good one I don't want to use it over here, otherwise I will become wanted. That was a nice one, but nobody, no star, so that's fine. Now I'm going to call my car from my, uh, now like I told you, to be once to wanted. Let's change the gun and just in case I need to fight some of them. Let's call up for my, from my contacts, I'm going to ask. Somebody just killed me. A uh, few little bit of money will be deducted from my account. That's if you USD. That's fine. Yeah, I have all of the guns. One sec. Yeah, that's perfect. Seems good to me. Now, since all of them have set it, I have I have already set up the nightclub. Let's go to the mess bank where I'm going to set up another business. Let's see how much money I can make from that business. Let's look in the map where that is. Mess bank is supposed to be around zoom out a little bit and then that's my property. Where is the mess bank? I uh, can see it on the map. Which is series ammunition, less and post, motorcycle club, movies, nightclub, open wheel, owned apartment, owned garage, premium risk, risk series. This one. That is the one. White Enterprise office. Let's go over there and set up another business. I'm also going to ask my pool car and they're going to charge me some money. Let's just ask for it. Raise awesome. And that's the job. Contacts is over here. Let's call. Now, uh, the mechanic, uh, once it picks up, you can ask for your delivery of the car. Yeah. Turismo R, this is my favorite car so far. So I'm close to my personal vehicle. Doesn't really matter. Uh, let's see, where is my car right now? In the white portion over there, is there my car? Let's get back. Once I get inside the car, uh, I think uh, that's not the car actually I was asking for. I was asking for the another car that looks quite cool, drives really well. The mechanic once again. Let's see if I can deliver me the car that I'm looking for. Turismo R. Forward classic, I guess. Turismo is not saying that I'm too close to my apartment, so let's get to this car only. Was it my car or someone else? Oh, that was my car accidentally. Took someone else's car. Let's see if I can find a good car on the highway. Let's get inside the maze bank and set up my new business. Doesn't seem that I'm going to get a good car. So let's continue with this one only. Okay, that was unfortunate. Let's keep moving now. You can also play missions to make some money, but right now I'm just going to open another business.
Okay, I thought that will that impact will break that pole, but it didn't work out quite well over here. Let's get to the mesh bank as fast as possible, and then once I insert it, uh, I will set up the new business. And once that is done, I don't know how much will it cost, but I have some money right now. With that, I can set up a few businesses. And I'm making constant money from the other businesses, and I will visit the nightclub. Once again, to let's see if the operations are going quite well. Or did the operation even start? I don't know for sure because that was weird. It doesn't happen like that. This it was night time and suddenly it's turned morning. And I don't I can't see any good card in this region. That's just one of the cards that looks quite good. Let's try to get inside that card. Then get to the maze bank. I think I can see my bank from there. That is the one, the left side. That's my office, I think. Turn over here and yeah, that's the one. I am into my personal maze bank property. This is my office. Let's get inside the office. Into my office. I take a while to load. Here I am inside my office. There's a personal assistant who is greeting me. And the PC is over in this side. Let's access this PC and from here I can actually access my businesses. I'm going to buy a new business. I have to be the CEO once again. First, they stand up and become the CEO. Here also, CEO. You can hire associates. You can also ask the people to actually uh, come into this job for you and then do a lot of different kind of things. I don't need to bribe the authorities right now. But XLS, there is, okay, there's ramp, all of them are blocked right now. Patriot, Stretch, is it available right now? So the free also, but inventory, uh, let's see if there is anything inside the inventory. Body armor. Show armor. Super light armor, that's the one I have. Let's not open the armor right now. Purchased it and wanted to use. Heavy revolver. Those are not the ones that I'm going to look for. Let's see if I can start it from the PC one second. That's the desktop computer. Now I can access the business. Click on the login option over here. The special cargo option, the vehicle cargo option. Both of them can make you money. Now these are too expensive. I cannot buy that one. This is affordable, but let's go with the small ones that are much cheaper.
let's go with the vehicle cargo let's go with the it's too expensive too expensive too expensive all of them are too expensive so of course i cannot purchase them right now So let's purchase a special cargo uh, the small ones would be the one that i can actually buy right now i can go with that one three seventy k two k So let's go with the this one. Small one, sixteen crates, lame. Let's buy this one. Confirm. So now I have one hundred k, and I will be setting up this business on the next video. But for now, let's have a art and antique. Buy that. Confirm. That should be it now. I have I have ninety eight k, so that's it now. Right now I don't really need to. Not going to into inside the business. I'll go inside the business later on. Right now, what all I'm going to do is check out the uh, nightclub, and then once I see the nightclub. Is it to the ground? Let's see if everything is all right. And once everything is all right, I can close this video after that. Let's see if the nightclub is working properly and doing something for me. Assistant is calling. So I will be going over there later on. I have a car over here. Let's get inside the car. Let's go to my nightclub. Now it's asking me to go to the vantage point right now to finish the mission, I guess. But like I told you, right now I am going to the nightclub, and later on I can come into the place. Set it up. If I am going to the other side of this if, um, continue to follow that then it will take quite some time and not going to do that in this video so let's find the nightclub and then close this video the next video i'm going to go to the follow the yellow line and set up my new establishment that i purchased cargo establishment but right now I purchased that because it said that there are really less interference from the police so useful part from over there and let's get inside the nightclub and is the spot let's turn over and go from this one Let's go to the spot. Let's go to the nightclub and see if the business is actually running or we need to do something in order to make it work. Let's go to the nightclub. This car is also quite nice. Is this Chevrolet car? I don't know. Not sure. Looks kind of like that. I 
handling is however uh, not the best i'm almost there going to reach the night club in a moment there it is cannot enter the night club is it because of the mission over there okay so i have to first acquire the goods from my warehouse i have to go to the vantage point first need to complete that and then only i can go to the night club so let's do that first then and then only i can go to the night club to turn from here Hope is closed because it's hard to completely identify how far is the vantage point just from the map. Let's go straight and then to the left. and to the left i don't know what kind of goods i need to collect in order to start the business I definitely have to do something okay almost there and do i have to go down from the car or I understand i do have need to enter the building in so not yet i think i will be needing the car to get to the vantage point okay can't quite understand exactly where is the vantage point it appears i am on the spot yet i cannot see anything let's get to the other side and wait over here we can see i think uh, that is the place from where i have to enter let's get inside again and the stairs let's get down these are the stairs from where i think i might need to let's get a gun just in case i need to kill somebody no nope, it doesn't seem so still not here i am just moving around the point but still can't identify where exactly is the point is this the place yeah there it is so i need to go upstairs or was it downstairs let's check the downstairs first and then can I enter it i don't seem so so i have to go up upstairs and then again once again i have to go upstairs 
Okay. Now I have to go somewhere around that place. So I have to assassinate someone using this gun. Locate and take out the target. Take the gun. Let's see. Target details. Hobo. Let's find Hobo. I have no clue where to find it. But I need the gun to just kill that one. Is that the gun? Think so. And where can I find Hobo? That's difficult to find. Okay, I chose the vantage point, which means I have to take a ride. Let's go to the right. Then once I am over there, I have to kill Hobo. Okay, it's not tough for it to get in. I understand that one. Uh, that's weird. We can't go inside the car since parked at a weird spot. There must be a car over here. A nice one. That was a nice car, and I think I can get that one if I reach there on time. Got that one. Got three minutes left. Need to reach the vantage point right now. Okay. Let's see where is Hobo. Get it. So I need to upstairs once again but I can't see anyone named Hobo is that Hobo where is Hobo now I am one star wanted bribe the authorities to remove one to start but that's something i don't want to do right now there's this inside over there pick out the target is the option but i cannot see the target ask me to go to the vantage point so let's go to the vantage point once again and it doesn't seem that i have killed the target yet oh no that's not the spot of course a mistake. It's hard to find where the target is. Let's see if I can see the target from the upstairs. Just one minute left. Where is the vantage point? I don't see it. Is it from here to the other side? Doesn't seem to be the target. Can I see the target over there? Is there a green sign over there? And that was not accepted. 
I think I lost the mission. Oh no, I am still in the mission, however. Doesn't seem that I can do a lot of things. Cannot. So there is a red one over there. I think that's the target. I think I found the one. I have some time. Let's see if I can do something about that. I will take it from this side. Twenty-eight seconds. I don't think I can reach there. Even with this car. Not that far away. I think I should have looked at the map where I would kill that one, but let's see if I can make it out in time. Just a little bit, I don't think I want to make some reason. That's it. Transaction pending and lost some money over there. made some money also 1794 that was quite something that card looks nice I don't think I can get that card however the monster wanted and so since I couldn't collect the cargo right now uh, I will recollect it, recollect it later on. And till then, um, I'm going to go to the nightclub. Let's go to the nightclub. Let's mark it on the map and then go to the nightclub. The nightclub is supposed to be let's see nightclub there it is let's do a turn and Let's go over there. To the right. And let's see if the nightclub is running quite well or is it okay or do I need to do something over there? Not so sure. It's too fast and I to go to the nightclub. It's a two star and that's not something I wanted. There are a few cops coming from that side. Need to move out from them. Go straight and then to the left. This car is severely damaged and handling has handling is not working really well. So that's an issue. Is there any rich car? Which which guy car over here? No. Let's get going and with this car only, and I will reach there shortly. That was a respawning. I think that was a play over there.
So I rank up and I'm a thug. I'm almost there in front of my nightclub. There it is. Let's see if the basement operations are going quite well. Or do I need to do something else? Let's get to the elevator first. A couple of people are always partying over here. It doesn't matter what which day it is, what time it is. They just love partying and they just keep on partying all the time. It's good for me because I'm making up quite a lot of money from here. Have to find the stairs. Sometimes it gets a little confusing over here. Where are the stairs? Let's get to the computer over here. And let's see if I am making some money from here. The popularity is decreasing, so is my money. Right now, I'm not going to do some promotion. Later on, I can do some promotion. So right now, uh, what I have decided to reduce the overall tax so that overall entry fee. Because right now, my entry fee is around 25 USD. And that, that could be affecting. I don't know whether that is related or not. So available goods are two. Cargo and shipments are available now. Confirm if someone is also doing that. Okay, so there are two of them actually. It's gonna take some time, and yes, there are no goods so far. Don't have it. I think we to hire this technician. So that's it, I think. So the nightclub is working quite well. I'm not going to promote it right now. The income is decreasing, as you can see. And later on, it will continue to increase when, once I do something else about it. So first, and let's do reduce the overall entry fee for this nightclub management let's reduce the entry fee to 10 usd that's it and that could increase the popularity i don't know so that's it i think so i will be looking at the uh, earning from the warehouse management later on because that is the first time it has started so i will look at it later on and i have other businesses where i need to look at Right now, none of them are needed. So I will conclude this video with this one. So that's it for this video. If you really like this video, don't forget to click on the like, comment, and subscribe button. And hope you enjoyed the video. That's it. Bye-bye.